speak French. I'm, I'm trying to read. The main thing that I saw, of course, was thank you to everybody and objective one, two, and three. So that's what we want to talk about. Um, actually, I do, my conversation will be very brief. Uh, Marie, you tell me if you think it's necessary to stop me, and, but very brief. Brian, our President Albrecht, Dr. Brian Albrecht, said it best when the value of the cooperation is for building capacity at an institutional level in Kenosha, Wisconsin, and in Wujda, Morocco. So that's, that's the value. And what the partnership has brought to us through this time is, is learning and building and growing and developing opportunities. So that is the basis of the partnership. And I'll go on to, to thank some people. But I, I certainly can't say everybody's name. I'll, I'll be honest. My, my French, my area, I, I, I can't do that. But I know that the three students we've met recently, and we brought one student from the USA, and they'll be speaking a little bit later. Can some of the students who have been touched by the product development, the rapid prototyping, and the Biz Squad, could you guys stand? Could you guys stand? Les étudiants. Prototypage. So the, this is the reason, this is the purpose. May I ask, I do not see all of the instructors and professors, and there's many, many that are involved. Would you stand and show, and <coughs> Rahal, would you? Um, Mohammed back there, he's a businessman, he's not an instructor. Zeradine, these are the people who will build that capacity and will cascade the capacity and will, will learn and share and develop. So this is the reason for the project and our, our gratitude. So I want to thank you. So now I'll be a little more formal. So thank you. Thank you. There we go. I, I first and foremost have to thank um, USA, our government, for the funding opportunity to allow us to do this. Without that, this wouldn't be possible. I must say it. It's uh, the money comes from the American people. It's from the American people, so, but you are the facilitator. Right. HED is the guide. So USAID is, is the agency of the American people that does the funding. HED, Higher Education for Development, has helped with the management and the guidance, particularly in the beginning for our project, Marilyn Crane, was instrumental in the success of this project. And now we have Angela Mugle. I, did I say that? Mugle. Mugle, Mugle, like the Mughal Empire. And Angela Mugle who will help us and guide us through that. We had the leadership of our colleges, President Sadak. You and Brian work together to create the partnership. And without that, at the high level, and without the instructors and the students, so from top down and bottom up, that's the success of of the partnership. With many people, the leadership of the project, it was equal and shared. Uh, Dr. Felder, who's not with us, but who created the project in partnership with each stakeholder on the team. Dr. Benazi, Larvi Toaf, who was instrumental, Samia Bakal, and, and I can't go through everybody, but Zara D, Raw Hall, Majda, Kaj, Sadia, um, Afa, everybody. It, so, so I won't go through everybody's name, but everybody who made a difference and, and makes those connections at an individual and a relationship level, but at the business level, right there, with, with you at the table, with the politicians at the table. With Nick, in the picture of that snap on in the center was Nick Pinchuk, an international CEO one of the smartest men I have ever met, the most visionary, and he supports this project on the automotive side. And then on our project, there, Gateway has two projects. Somewhere in there, I'm sure that was located. But Gateway has two projects. And 
This project has associations like the National Business Incubation Association, the Wisconsin Business Incubation Association, the International Economic Development Corporation, we have Iger Labs, Rock Valley Community College, we have expertise throughout. And then of course we have the expertise of leaders, positive leaders like Cheryl Euchre who helped develop that biz squad and helped create and guide and make it a model to fit you, not our model, here it is, but a model that works for you. Talia Mendez who helped manage the coordination and the training and the facilitation and Tracy Kitts who it's unfortunate he's not here today, but who has the expertise and the knowledge of business incubation at, a, at an international level. Now, he would be the one moving forward as we look, we're talking about sustainability. And we'll have a talk on Thursday about sustainability, how each objective will live with funding or without funding. So with funding, we might reach the businesses and say, this is a value. Without funding, we still will make this continue and live. We just have to work on our plan a little bit. And so we will have individuals work on this and build this. And we want it to be sustainable. You see the International Student Exchange, which Zena Haywood, Ray Kakari, the Dean Ray Kakari, Cheryl Euchre, our US students will come here and visit. I hope that one of you can stay in my home when you come and visit. That would be wonderful. Thank you very much. That would be wonderful. So, I think that's good. And Marie, of course, Marie Batar. I, you can come to you. Thank you for inviting us at home. Absolutely. You can. You can. Continue your, your speech. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. I was okay because you know what? I really, I just have to say thank you for the opportunities. Really, the most important people that you're going to hear today, and maybe from the business perspective, it's a little different, but to us, and what our goals and our objectives were, it is the students, the instructors, but it is the students and their energy and their excitement, and the, and, and the student who, who put a piece of bone together and made a prototype, that's an emerging market you don't even know about. I, I mean, you do, but it's not, the businesses don't even know what they don't know yet. So we have their story to share, and that's the most value, not, not mine. I'm just grateful, Gateway Technical College is grateful to have served on this project and to continue to serve and to build friendships and relationships that will last for years. So thank you. Before uh, giving uh, the speech for students to have uh, a testimony, uh, the president invite us to take uh, a photo for the group, uh, so as to be uh, all together on the photo, just for one minute. Yeah, <laughs> 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 